National Football League, Chicago Bears ownership group now owns a 326-acre Arlington International Racecourse property in Arlington Heights, Illinois, and the ownership already has a major problem. Feels the property's assessment is too high. Cook County Assessor Fritz Kage reset the land value to $197 million, which is a major increase from its previous tax value of roughly $33.5 million. Bears ownership has cried foul and wants a reevaluation as soon as possible. Bears ownership paid $197.2 million for the property. Bears ownership filed an appeal to the three-member Cook County Board of Review and put out a statement that the new assessment was excessive. As of right now, it would cost Bears ownership about $15 million a year in additional tax compared to the previous valuation. Bears ownership put out a statement claiming it wants to be a good neighbor in the area, but the property taxes are a bit too much. We want to pay our fair share, but the proposed assessment of the unoccupied property we purchased and the taxes associated with it would be more than five times what the property generated when it had an incoming producing racetrack operation on it. Arlington Park would not be redeveloped by anyone at such an excessive property tax rate. But Bears ownership plans to build a stadium village on the parcel of land, and if everything goes according to the Bears ownership plan, the property will be making money, and Arlington Heights wants its fair share. Bears ownership is moving ahead in its attempt to develop the property, as it is requested a permit to demolish the Arlington racetrack buildings. Bears ownership has a lease with the city of Chicago's Soldier Field until 2023, but it could leave after 2026 by paying the city of Chicago $84 million to break the lease. I'm Evan Weiner.